Poke Collect. Yeah, guys, we actually got a Poke Collect mystery box. Uh, saw this on another YouTube channel. Thought we might give it a shot. I know we've been doing a lot of Shining Fate stuff, so I wanted to see if we can get some, you know, a different variety of cards. Hopefully some really big hitters. Hopefully nothing that we already have. That's what I'm really looking for. I want some a little bit more variety in my life. So we're gonna get the close-up angle and let's get started. All right, guys. Um, we got battle styles first. They do give you a booster pack in the uh, the mystery box just for you know. I guess just a little extra fun. Which we are not fond of. Oh man, yeah. See, that's why we're not fond of battle styles. We don't really open a lot of battle styles on this channel because, well, per their pull rates are just terrible. I know we are going to be opening up some soon. A little bit more, it's probably some ETBs, just because we haven't really done it. There you go, Drampa as the rare. <laughs> That's why Battle Styles sucks, and their booster boxes are going for a hundred bucks. It's really sad. All right, cool. I've been looking forward to these Poke Collect mystery boxes for I'd say about I don't know a couple weeks. Uh, saw the video. Of course, these videos for these really top like, Pokemon guys um, are way, they always get hooked up and they get, you know, really cool cards uh, a lot of the times. Just so that people will go ahead and go to the, oh, that's cool. That's just like on Sword and Shield, that little area with the little bridge and the grass. Zigzagoon, a skateboard, full heel. Ooh, a cool Lucario. Dang, okay, see, I like this. A lot of cool things I haven't actually pulled. Agnazone, Tyranitar. Sweet. That's just a, a regular holographic. That's a really cool card. I'm actually, <laughs> I'm actually really. Oh, uh, sweet. What do we got here? Got a Salazzle. An awesome Polyrath. Do they even have a Stunkfish? A Stunfish? Quagsire, just chilling. Oh, a beautiful Lapras card. That makes it, I feel like that's more like a realistic card. It looks kind of like a uh, Golden Gate Bridge, but it's not, obviously not. Houndoom looking awesome. Talonflame looking awesome. <sighs> Look at these Doug Trios. You just don't mess with those guys. I mean, I wouldn't. Whoa, there you go. Trevenant. All right, put those off to the side. And our first top loader. I know people are having issues trying to get these things out. Oh, they had it upside down. That's kind of weird. Okay, let's see what we got for the first card. Oh, it's upside down. And the Heatran. Oh, nice. Shiftry GX. Again, that's really cool. See, I, I haven't had, I haven't pulled a lot of these cards, so this is really nice that we're already getting stuff we have not seen before. I'm gonna put that right back in there. Not sure what I'm gonna keep in the top loaders, but I mean, that will probably go back in the top loader. What I really like about this to collect stuff. I like how they packaged everything. It's really cool. All right, so, oh, look, looks like some Shining Fade stuff, huh? So more Peko. Tropius Reverse, Choodle Reverse. Yeah, this is, oh, nope, not all Shining Fades. There's an Arbok. That's a really cool looking card. Oh, a Raikou Reverse Hollow. That's pretty sweet. Salazzle, Your holographic, pretty sweet. I really like that Raikou. That's really cool. And top loader. Uh, I wish they labeled these because there's like different ones. Like, oh, you'll have a you'll have a god, um, uh, like a god pack. But you never really know like what it is. So again, upside down. Hatrine, regular holographic. And a Houndoom V, pretty cool card, but we do have this card. That's pretty cool. A 
nothing too crazy yet. A lot of these actually like un uncommon cards um, I don't have. So it's actually, that's actually pretty cool. All right, what do we got? Some reverses. That's pretty cool. Nice real uh, reverse mill tank. That's a really cool card. Oh, holographic Machamp. That's actually pretty sweet. Uh, is that from? Um, that's from Battle Styles. I mean, Battle Styles. I guess have a couple cool cards. A, a regular Hollow Scent to Scorch. Professor's Research. Boom. And the top loader. Gonna get for this bad boy. I never know which way is up. Oh, 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 Crobat VMAX, the promo uh, from their back. Oh, and then you go, Noshawat. Well, that's sweet. What is that from? They got like that Pokemon League emblem back there. That's pretty sweet. I don't know what that is, but this reverse hollow is actually really cool. I don't know if you guys can see, it's kind of, it's not actually textured, but that's really cool. We do have a Crobat VMAX because we did it by a premium box, but this is a really sweet card. Uh, I actually want to get a few of them graded, see if we can get a 10 in that. So that is nice. Oh, here we go. We got a Japanese card back there. Open this thing up. Oh, it's, oh, it is. There is one on the top loader, too. Sweet. So this must be uh, one of their Japanese ones. Oh, sweet. Gengar. That's really cool. Holographic Gengar. Oh, that's pretty awesome. I really like that. And behind that, we got a... Oh, a Cinderace. Oh, there's more. There's Cinderace. Holographic. Oh, and a Raikou. A Raikou. Holographic. Very nice. The Japanese coming in strong, especially these two. I love these. I probably love the Gengar the most. I don't, I don't get a lot of Gengar cards, so that is really cool. I'm gonna put those back in the penny sleeve, but that's awesome. And what's in the top loader? Those are actually some really sweet cards. And in the back, let's see. Oh, it's some kind of V. Uh, ditto V in Japanese. <laughs> of course we have this car, but not in Japanese, so that's pretty cool. And behind that is a... What on earth is that? I don't even know that Pokemon. But whatever, we don't have it, so <laughs> we'll take it. Man, I love those Japanese cards. I do like opening the Japanese pack. All right, so our last mystery pack. Hopefully it's something pretty cool. Pull that up. Oh, another one. But that's a V. Oh, this must be the full V. Ooh, a Raichu or a Raichu GX. I think that's the promo. And a grab locked V. We don't have that. That's pretty sweet. Is that a Battle Styles card? All these fighting stances. I'm always like, it's gotta be Battle Styles, right? If I mean, if that's a battle stuff, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna put that Raichu GX in the front. That's a pretty sweet card. That's from Hidden Fates, I believe. I believe this is the one that comes with the tin, but I'm not 100% sure on that. So if I'm if I'm correct, this should be two, you know, really nice V cards. I think I think that's how it works. I'm not positive on that, so if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But it does look like a V card. Oh, 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 never mind. I thought that was gonna be something else. EVV Max, this is from the Shining Fates ETV. So we do have that card quite often. And our last card of the day is going to be a <laughs> Whimsicott GX. Another card we don't have, so that's cool. But nothing massive today. So we're hoping to get at least you know, a couple, or even just one, you know, big, big hitter. But we do have quite a few cool cards in here. Um, I really like that Gengar. This is probably my my favorite card of the uh, mystery box, actually. The Shifter GX is just, I, I like the greens. I love the green cards. I have a Rowlet and a Lowland Executor card. 
Uh, that's really pretty and there's a lot of green in it. So pretty cool. Um, this box is, I think it was going for like 70 bucks, 65, 65, 70 bucks. I mean, you are guaranteed some sweet cards. So, I mean, if you, you can spend that much and you're not going to get this many, you know, VMAXs and GXs. So is it worth it? I would say yes, especially if you get some big, really big hitters. We, again, we didn't get any big hitters, but, um, definitely a nice lot of cards and a lot of, um, different cards so all right guys that was a lot of fun I, I i enjoyed the mystery box you know we don't get too many mystery boxes so uh if you guys like that i can always invest in a little bit more put all of my money that i make into child's cardboard it's okay i don't mind it i actually enjoy it so uh we're gonna do some battle styles etbs here soon probably within the week and we're also got our hands on some unified minds for us a uh, pack from dollar general you know those three card packs so uh, hopefully we get lucky. I think we got about like 40 of those packs. So we got at least got to get you know, one good pull out of that. But uh, we'll see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed.